Come on, you can do it. <laughs> Is warrior one? Yeah. Warrior two? Warrior two? <laughs> Reverse we, your warrior. Reverse my warrior. <laughs> oh my god, Philly. <laughs> warrior three. You can do it. Come on, come on, straight. Lock your knees, lock your knees, lock your knees. Hey, lock legends. Your. This is struggling, Mike. But your focus shouldn't be on me. It should be on her. That's Bumi Flex. A great performer or dancer, but even better, a yogi enthusiast. On this episode of Beyond Ordinary Students, we talk about yoga, its misconceptions, and I also get to practice yoga. Enjoy. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm good. How did you like find out you wanted to do yoga? I know the most the questions I get most of the time is how did I know I'm flexible, blah 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 because it all started from there. But I found yoga in twenty seventeen. Uh-huh. After I did appendicitis surgery. Oh wow. I actually knew about yoga before then, but mm, not like something serious. I mean at secondary school, you don't really take anything serious like that. So I was I was in Bowen. My first semester, I don't know. I just had appendix, so I should go home. I did surgery. You know, oh. so I was like walking somehow. Like, you know, when your back is like bent forward, like you can't walk straight. So that's how I was like for two months, and I, I could not stretch. I could like I was kind of stiff, and I was kind, I was like flexible before then. So like, I could not do so many things again. I like it was so hard. Then I went on Instagram, you know, thing, yoga. Okay, so yoga. You went through like yoga for back pain, you got to stretch your muscles. And I was like, okay, then I went deeper into it. Then, you know, now I saw some stretching exercises. I started doing it. And gradually, I was able to walk fine, you know. Oh, wow. So, let's say yoga kind of helped me. So, I went into it fully. How was the surgery experience? <laughs> <laughs> it was bad. <laughs> no, Kamak okay, Power, it was bad. Because, okay. I mean, normally, I don't really have stomach pain. Like, I don't usually have stomach pain. Mm-hmm. The medical students, so you should understand. Yeah, understand. Um, ladies, when they normally um, in their period, they have cramps, cramps and all. Yeah. I don't experience that. So that morning, devotion, I was actually sleeping on the floor that night because I had one class, one Mr. Faye's class, that time in 100 level, when they scare you, lecturer, this lecturer, that. So now, I was reading for the test, but I was like on the floor throughout the night, trying to read, oh, hey. And I wanted to stand up, I noticed that my stomach was spinning and all, oh, like, it was bad. They should have rushed me to the clinic. The nurses were in their own, nurses, doctors were in their own. The doctor did not come and attend to me, now he was like, eh, the appendix. <laughs> Just slide it open and bring it out. I was like, Did you do it in Bowen here? Yeah. Really? I didn't do it in Bowen. Okay. No, hearing that, will you do it in Bowen? No. <laughs> it was not encouraging at, at all. all. Like my parents came, they took me home. I was even thinking I was going home to you know eat Amala. <laughs> <laughs> they carried me to the hospital straight and that day, that day that the shadow removed the appendix. It was bad, it was really bad because I could not sleep on time and they could not do the surgery for me a week and it was it was it was messy, it was really messy. But we thank God you are here. Yeah. Alive. Helping us okay. you know go on the yoga journey. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Apart from the yoga helping you treating your back muscles and it, has there been any other thing that you feel it has helped you with okay people practice yoga for different reasons actually mm-hmm. you can either be practicing yoga to become more flexible you can practice yoga for peace of mind you can practice yoga to just you know be away from this whole ups and down you can practice yoga for weight loss you can just practice yoga for anything serious yes oh i didn't know that me oh i actually practice yoga because apart from the fact that I have my back, I practice yoga to like stay more flexible. Because you know now we go to classes, we are like doing this, doing that. You don't have time to like stretch and all. So like ten minutes, five minutes, maybe you are done with your activities of the day, you just like find time to stretch. And see it's really it's really soothing. Like yoga is ah, calming. It's calming, trust me. And there are times that um before um exams I try to like do yoga, so you know. Oh. Yoga that's, works that's... for anything. <laughs> Actually, yoga works for anything, anything in this world. I says for the spiritual thing. I don't know. No, 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 no. It works for spiritual. But like you know, I don't know it's about that one. Actually, there's the spiritual yoga. There's the normal yoga. Yoga works for anything. I use yoga for anything, but mostly to stay flexible. 
Must someone be flexible to be able to do yoga? Yes, Greg. No, no, no. Are you all listening to me? <laughs> and oh, no, you don't have to be flexible to practice but yoga. Like, yes, okay, fine. Ninety percent of people you see doing yoga, they are flexible. Yeah. Do you know that most of them were not born flexible? Most okay. of them were not flexible, but because they started doing yoga, they became flexible. So if I started doing yoga, yoga I... helps you like stretch your muscle. So if I tell you to bend to the back, I'm sure you're not able to do it. Bend to the back. Huh? Yes. But like when you start like, practicing like, like that bend, same pose, like, yeah, yeah, like bend, 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 bend. Uh, we, we try to do that later. <laughs> when you actually like, you know, yoga, like, you have to practice it every day or once in a while. If you continue practicing that particular part of your body, like you keep on stretching it, there's no how. The tightness is going to like release, so that part tends to get flexible. So you don't have to be flexible to practice yoga. I mean, it's not, they don't say yoga always for flexible people. Like I said, you practice yoga for anything, for different things. Me, I practice yoga to stay flexible. Okay, let's not lie, I was a bit flexible before, but practicing yoga actually helps me, my strength, my flexibility. It's increased everything, but you don't have to be flexible to start yoga at all. You don't have to. So if you want to start your yoga journey, you can start now. You can just... start. Just make sure you are like following the right procedures. Not that, but you know most people they just go online, just go and search for something. So let me do this thing. Now say your back is paining you, your arm is paining you. Just try to like um follow the right steps. That's why it's advisable to go for yoga classes to meet with professionals. Do you have any professional that you can recommend? Ah, they are plenty. Like how you, I recommend her. I'm not really a professional. <laughs> <laughs> um, almost, it may small like this. I should be a professional. I'm not really, but like we have them everywhere. Then um, you see them. They are called certified yoga instructors. Okay. See, most of them, most of them having the old um class gym thing. Do, do you know thing. anyone that like someone can find online? Okay, you guys should check out Official Wave. <laughs> he's, he's a contortionist and he's a certified 200 hour yoga teacher. If you stay in the bad door, he's, he, he actually stays in the bad door. He's so good. Like, he's really good. He's so good. We have a lot in Lagos too. We have likes of the Flex. We have likes of, I mean, Abuja. We have Cynthia. We have so many of them. It means small. I'll be in Ogun State waiting for you people. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a plug. So. Mm-hmm. People who want to start like a yoga journey, do you have any advice for them? I know how to give advice. <laughs> you want to do yoga? Come and do yoga. But yoga, it's a journey. I mean, forever. It's like when you start yoga, it will be so hard to like come out of it because of whatever you would find in it and all. So I don't know how to give advice, but I'll tell you. See, yoga is ah, uh, yoga is life saving. You hear different stories about people. You most people tell yoga save their lives. You know, like in Nigeria, we are we are okay. Go to the abroad. Ah, oh, we should we should do this alone. Like, like you, you you get what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So like, yeah. check most of them on Instagram. People that are based in, um abroad, you see most of them telling yoga save their lives. Some from um PTSD, okay. all this mental, mental. Even like it it actually helps a lot because there is there is it's like a kind of therapy doing yoga. So like if you are going to you know anything, you think you know I, I, that's the way I can advise you to start yoga. Do yoga, it's life saving. Trust me, and it's soothing. It brings peace of mind. You want to be flexible, like I can do yoga. Oh. Bumi is going to be taking me through some beginner yoga session, and like I just, I'll just try mm-hmm. to you know see what I can do there. <laughs> Please be, be be gentle with me. <laughs> so I will be taking my um, few um, beginner poses in yoga, standing poses and seated poses. Poses you do when you are standing or you are seated. The first one is sun salutation pose. It involves uh, warrior one, warrior two, warrior three. Okay. Mm-hmm. So to do warrior one, left leg is like going to like, yeah, do it. Come, here, come, come. Oh, okay. It's like you're going to like inch forward, then lock your knees at the back. Then make sure your leg is like facing forward or 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. Where's 12 o'clock? 12 o'clock. <laughs> That's me like, too. 12 mm, o'clock. Okay, okay. Then your hands are like this. This is uh, Oreo one. <laughs> oh. Like this. 
Oh. <laughs> okay. Let, balance. Let, let, let me try. Yoga let me try. will teach you. Yoga will teach you balance. Let me start let's, doing let's, this. Let's one. try. Let's try again. Like this. This is warrior one. Okay. So warrior two. Um, stretch your hand like this. Let me make sure your leg is like facing one o'clock. Like the one at the back, right? Yes. One o'clock. Lock your knees. Are you locking your knees? Yes, I think so. <laughs> Like this, this is warrior oh two. Show you warrior three. So it's step back. So <laughs> this is um warrior three. Wow. You need a lot of balance to be able to do it. <laughs> you need a lot of balance to be able to warrior three. So warrior three is like this. Oh, so. So like my left it. leg forward, right? And my right leg backward. Yes. Yeah, where's your back leg up? Where's it up? What, which leg? Your back leg. Yeah. <laughs> Straighten it. It's not straight. Lock your knees at the front. Okay. Yeah. And you look forward. Then you. It's actually a beginner, so you get it's understandable. So that's warrior three. Ah. So. Wow. Warrior one. Warrior two. I didn't teach you reverse warrior. When you say reverse warrior, do like this. This one actually kinds of stretch your back at the same time a little sure. bit. Warrior so one. you are reversing your way. This is warrior one. Warrior two. No. Warrior two. <laughs> <laughs> oh my bet. Why you have too many pussies on your head? Sorry, Mike. I'm very sorry okay. for that mistake. But like this is warrior one. Uh, okay. Yeah. Warrior two. Oh. I, yeah. One o'clock then. Yeah, one o'clock. Then when I say reverse your warrior. Oh, okay. Then I go back. Oh. <laughs> Am I meant to touch my leg? <laughs> yeah, kind of. Oh, you okay. lock your lock your knees at the back, straighten it. Oh, it's meant to be straight. Yes, then this one is like still. Inch forward. Yeah. So you reverse your warrior. <laughs> then pretty make sure us what he learned so far. For your one. Come on, you can do it. <laughs> this is warrior one. Yeah. Warrior two. Warrior two. <laughs> Reverse Wait. your warrior. Reverse my warrior. <laughs> warrior three. <laughs> warrior three. You can do it. Come on, come on, straight. Lock your knees, lock your knees, lock your knees, lock your knees. Ah. Your knees. Ah. Good job. That is for beginner, like you get. I try, I try, I try. Uh. So you practice it every day. It actually Ooh. helps stability for balance. It helps to like stretch the muscles in the hand. Yeah, I feel that it. reverse warrior kind of you can't feel it at your back. Yeah, yeah. Kind of and how. So we are moving on more to <laughs> already. <laughs> okay, we are moving on to seated poses. To give you a transition, um, there's this um, if you do yoga, you should know this popular pose called downward dog variation. I know downward dog. Yeah, show me, show I, me I your down, downward dog. Downward dog is something like like ah, wait how is it so uh, you already got it to now you're yeah, yeah, spoiling it uh, like this okay yes <laughs> like something like this right yes kind of that's that what dog wish ah. because when a dog is like stretching you see them doing the old Ooh, okay. mm, so let me show you this transition imagine we are standing you go to your downward dog variation like this okay. then from downward dog Move to pigeon pose. <laughs> they like to do that. Yes, okay, let's, you move let's, to let's, your let's, pigeon let's see, pose. Let's see. So, can you see this transition? You bring your leg back to your downward dog. Then you walk to your legs. Then you come up. Yeah, so okay, let's go. Can, can, can you? Okay. Let's, let's go. Go, go Mikey. <laughs> go, Mikey. Downward go, Mikey. dog. <laughs> okay then i don't know how to how do you do this that you just is this it yes this is it Almost this it. is pigeon pose uh, i'm seeing to remain like this yes where well, you kind of look upward your legs are supposed to be like this at the back this like yeah, this like this sleeping on the floor uh, like this yeah uh, so guys this is pretty mike doing pigeon pose yeah but like am i meant to sit on this leg not really Oh, okay. I forgive you <laughs> because you're a beginner. Dig it. Yeah. Yeah. So then, as I'm coming back, I just. What do I do? The same way. You <laughs> <from there. 
Okay. Kind of want to go back to your downward duration. <sighs> yeah. As it walk to your yeah. legs. Oh, Turn your legs. hands up. Ah. We are good to go. <sighs> I'm not good to go. <laughs> Uh, okay. I would uh, like challenge your strength actually. This is uh, your girl, but you're, you're a man, so you're strong. <laughs> so, guys, let me show you something. So, um, it's also seated pose, but you do this. Um, um when they um yogi sit, they mostly sit in um either lotus lotus pose or fire lock pose. This is fire lock pose. Like this. Yeah. Uh, okay. This is where you go into the old. Do you mind doing something like this? Actually, you need flexibility to do this. Oh my God. <laughs> So you do I might be flexible, who knows? Then your second leg, you put it inside here. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's yeah. Go. Yeah. Ah. So from here, our hands are on the floor. What? Then you push up. My nails should not disturb me. I suppose like carry yourself up. Oh wow! Yeah. Ah. Uh, so God, my legs are killing me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I did die, I did die, I did die. <laughs> so oh, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, actually, some people feel pain. Um, yeah. In their knees because you actually have to stretch before, before anything. Before you start. But I wanted to challenge, you know. Ah, check out my, your strength. My triceps. And, uh, <laughs> what do <about, what laughs> you? Triceps, biceps. Hello, <laughs> yo, this one, can me? So uh, guys, no matter what you do, just try to like stretch before anything to avoid injury. I'm still suffering from one to date. It's really painful. So like, no matter what you do, always stretch, even if you are flexible. How, how did you get your injury? You know that if I say I know how the injury came to be, I don't know, but like I feel it's... Okay, this is what happened. You know how the yogi? I was supposed to be taking sugar so much. Oh. Yeah. Well, my own kind of yogi. <laughs> oh, God. So, like, my back is paining me. It has been paining me, like, for two years now. So, like, if you notice my Instagram post, I've not really been posting much of back pain. Oh. Do you okay. get? The only time I posted back pain was when I was doing this thing with a guy. Yeah, that's... So, it actually kind of stretches me. But, like, I was in pain. All those well. So they said it's sugar and all, but then me, I know that one way or the other, I didn't stretch before I probably did, yeah. did something. So like it's, it's, it's actually will cause injury if you don't stretch. Yoga is not spiritual, yoga is not harmful, yoga is not, I don't know, this all this meat. You don't have to be flexible to do yoga, you're not too fat to do yoga, you're not too thin to do yoga. Every kind of body can do yoga. So, guys. Yoga. <laughs> <laughs> Yoga will save your life. <laughs> this one to do more. I think I'm okay. Are you sure? You can still do more. Are you sure? Yes. Do you like to try to do the split? Which split? Like sp normal split split. They teach you can't to get to the shot. Hey, hey, that one too. Get your split in one day. Get your split in five days. I pity you. I pity. <laughs> well, it will, it will wound yourself. I just get your splits in. I don't know. Everybody in just five seconds. does this. <laughs> I mean, bro. For the views. Even if you are flexible, it's not just going to work like that because you have to like go into extreme stretch. The one I can believe is getting your split in thirty days, mm -hmm. or like you know the whole month thingy. Because I mean, your muscle goes through that same process every day, so it tends to open up. So you can't actually get the split today if I teach you. That's what if I can't really like. split? If you can already split it, hey. But like, if you are not flexible, I am expecting to get you. Why are you pointing at me if you are not flexible? No, no, I don't even get you on beside me now. Oh yeah, if you are not, if you are not flexible, I want to attempt this place. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> oh wow. Thank you so much guys for watching this video. I remain Bumi Flex and your host, your host, your awesome Aremu Mike. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, what again? download, <laughs> everything. Everything. That one shall. Trust me, you love his, his, his content. <laughs>